everyone, and today the guinea pigs are going to be trying some cherry for the first time. Chewy already had a piece because my friend wasn't filming and obviously he really likes it. Don't you, bud? Come here, pig. I'm going to be feeding the other pigs it. Where's Ahsoka? Are you, girl? Thief Ahsoka wants some of this. Come here, girl. Where are you? Come here. Chewy Baker. Come here. Come over here. She likes it. Do you spit it out? He's eating it. Chewy Baker. Yeah, Chewy has the habit of chewing the bar when he wants something. Did you eat it, girl? Yeah, you liked it. I want to feed every pig a piece first. Come here, pig. She has, she already has orange and green on her neck because I already fed them peppers and lettuce. And they were screaming for more. Oh my gosh, bud. Oh, Ray's come out. Come here, girl. All of a sudden, she started randomly sleeping underneath that ramp. I don't know what her leg is underneath that ramp. And she's just gone to bed. Girl. Oh, I just dropped her cherry. Come here. And she's like, girl, come here. Ray, wake up. Ray. I'm going to show Chibi eating one because he didn't get any. It's not a lot of cherry because I looked it up and they're only supposed to have one to two cherries. And all of this is only two cherries cut up. And I always thought cherries were red inside, but they're actually white. Now one for Ahsoka. She likes that. Ready? Is making Zori mad. Now all the pigs are eating. Forgetting about the cherry. All the pigs have left except for Soka. Chewy, because Ray has run off and made Zori mad. You girl. Let me give some to you, piggy. Come here. Earlier, I fed the other pigs peppers and. Ahsoka doesn't like peppers, and I tried giving her some, and she wouldn't take it, and then she heard everybody else eating, and she got really upset that she was being left out, didn't you, girl? And her screaming for food made everybody else scream for food, and we didn't have any other food because the cucumber went bad, so I decided to give them some cherries. Come here. Come here. Ray. Well, you know, Ray's hard of hearing, so. If you want some, gotta come back here, pig. Gotta get back here. Yes, you do. Go here. Sorry, you have a big mess on you. Come here. Sorry, come here. No? You don't want any cherry? Go bad. All three of them are begging now. I only have two pieces left. I'm going to try and split up into four pieces for the rest of the time. Four little smidgens left. The smithereens. The pigs ate their last little bits. There you go. Ray. And then one for Zori. Chewy now. Chewy! Stop it, bud. That's all you get. And then Chewy Baker. Here you go, girl. Really loved it, and Chewy's gonna stand here and chew the bar more. Aren't you, bud? Him and I always used to chew the bar. They used to always had that habit. And I need to show you something. I need to do a soak at dinner, girl. So, yesterday, was it? Yeah, yesterday. My mom and my dad were out. And I was here with my granny and my poppy. And I went to take a soka out. And I was, I didn't even notice anything. Was sitting on the couch. And all of a sudden I see her licking her paw. And I thought she was licking the pillow for some reason. And I look at her paw. And I see that it was wet, and I first thought it was wet, and I realized it was blood, and I looked at one of her toes, and the nail had um, ripped off all the way at the beginning of the quick, didn't it, girl? 
Yeah, and I didn't hear any screaming. That looks so painful. And she'd been sitting there with a, for a while, like two minutes, without me even realizing it. So it must have happened a bit earlier. Um, and I didn't even notice because she wasn't even crying or anything while she was staying there with me. And then I put in some powder and then it stopped bleeding. And my mom and dad were home. So I wrapped it up in some tape. And I can put a picture of her little booty that I made her at the end. So I wrapped it up in some tape and my mom got home. It was hanging on by a thread. So um, we had to cut it. But we had to cut the quick. It was like a tiny little bit left. But it didn't. she didn't scream at all. So I don't know. It must have been like that for a while. Her toes stopped beating anymore, and I can show you, she barely has any now left. I don't know if it'll regrow, it says if it's really damaged, it might not regrow, but it doesn't really matter. You don't really care, do you, Milk? No. And as you can see, she's being really friendly. She's getting to be really friendly. Yeah, she's quite happy with her life, living next to the herd. She interacts with them time to time, never fights with them, and seems to be fine with that. Yeah, she's as sweet as guinea pig with humans, but she absolutely hates other pigs when they get too close to her. So I'm going to show you her paw It's right going to be now. really challenging to show you. Okay, it's okay. But if you can see that toe right there next to that pink one is the one that it doesn't look that long compared to the other one but it, it was longer because that's a short animal as you can see it was like the length of that one right there and then it broke it wasn't even that long like from the quick she must have caught it on something excuse me she must have caught it on something can i see your paw please and you see it's not bleeding or anything but it's really short now but it doesn't cause her any pain and she's being a really good girl with us and we love you with Yoga, don't we? So yeah, that's the video for today, guys. Thanks for watching. And may the best be with you. Bye!